Heavenly Father, the great I am, the lily in the valley, you are the bright and morning star. We gather today, this morning, this afternoon, this evening, all over the world. And we gather in your name, in the name of Jesus. We thank you. Have a heart filled of thanks and gratitude. You have been so good been so good. You've been so kind. You've been so loving. You've been our shield, our buckler. You've been our refuge. You've been our protector. And we pause right now with a unified voice and we say thank you. Thank you. Thank you. For making us in your image. Thank you. Thank you. For down through the years. You have been our hope. In times of trouble. You've been our joy in sorrow. You've been our peace in the midst of turmoil. Hallelujah. You've been our multiplier. In times of financial struggles, you have made a way time and time again. You so many throughout the world to touch, to strengthen, to heal, to help, to deliver, to comfort. You've used so many of our brothers and sisters in the body of Christ. Ah, you use so many professionals We pray for professionals, Lord Jesus. When we say professionals, Lord, we're saying volunteers. We're not saying professionals because of the amount of money, the accolade, how hard it was to become one. We say professional, Lord, because of their approach. How they've been so caring. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you Lord. Hallelujah, Lord. Hallelujah. Here in America, we celebrate Veterans Day on tomorrow. We thank you for all the men and women. Thank you, God. Both past and present. that have given a portion of their life to protect a society, to protect the government, to protect national doctrines, to keep the adversary from imposing their will on us. Some have and are even now serving on foreign soil. Some are serving in places 
unrecognized by our government. Some are serving places, Lord, where the enemy is striving each day to snuff them out, to destroy the mission. So we thank you, Lord, for those, Lord, walking, flying, selling, and marching all over the earth. David was a warrior. So many were warriors. So many, the Bible talks about spies and those in espionage sneaking in to scout out and to deliver a report. So we thank you for all of the intelligence gathering organizations, those that watch radars, those that do not carry weapons, those that sit in offices and watch air traffic and those that are alert on different borders and those, Lord, that are handling dogs, Lord, and searching for explosives and drugs, Lord, those that are serving uh, omelets and those who are serving drinks, whether they're in the field or in the dining facility, the mess hall, the child hall, or those that work, Lord, in hospitality, Lord, and those that ensure that when airmen and soldiers and marines and seamen, Lord, land, no matter where they land, there is a place for them to lay their heads. We thank you for them. We thank you, Lord, for those that work in supply and logistics and transportation, Lord, that ensure that aircraft and helicopter and ship and uh, armament and everything that's needed is deployed into foreign locations and forward locations. Lord, we thank you, Lord Jesus, for the maintainers. Those, Lord, just that work on vehicles and aircraft, aerial space ground equipment, and those, Lord, that load weapons, Lord, and those that maintain weapon systems, Lord, and those, Lord Jesus, that do so many tasks. People would have no idea, but they wear a uniform. They identify with a larger cause. Some have given all. Some have sacrificed their lives, their health, have put their families in danger just by identifying with the country. And Lord, we celebrate them. We ask you, Lord, to protect them and to continue to look after them, Lord, even those, Lord, that carry scars, not only in their body, but scars in their mind. Years later, those that can't sleep, out a weapon near the bed. Those that get up in the night and walk around their apartment, their house, their mansion, making sure it's safe again. Those that suffer from post-traumatic stress disorder and have a hard time dealing with others. Some who have had their sleep disturbed for the rest of their lives. For those we owe a gratitude of thanks. We ask you, Lord, to look over them. Look over us. Those that are still being treated for things that happened while they were serving their country. Send your hand of protection. Protect Shield, Lord. Yes. Lord, we pray 
that this government, this great country, never forgets the cost, never forgets those that they have sent into dangerous areas. Let them never, Lord, take it lightly when they decide to load sons and daughters onto aircraft, onto ship, and send them out to fight. Let them never take that for granted. Let them never take that lightly. So we celebrate those that are yet serving. Bless them. Strengthen them, Lord. Keep them, Lord. Our sons and daughters heroically serving. Those that said they would go wherever they're needed and that they would fight no matter the foe. Those that swore, Lord Jesus, and solemnly affirmed that they would not turn back. That they would continue no matter the adversary, no matter the odds. Those that have confirmed that they will follow the orders. Uh, keep them, Lord. Keep them, Lord. Protect them and shield them, Lord. Bring them home to their families in the right mind. We come right now, Lord Jesus, for those, Lord, who even now are fighting suicidal ideations. Those are contemplating harm. Those that are looking on themselves, Lord, as being less than because of what they've seen. Because of the assignment they've been instructed to carry out. Some have seen some things so heinous. That they never talk. Ah Lord. They need your help. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Ah we pray for them now. Ah glory. We pray for them now. Help them Lord. Those that feel Lord. That they are beyond salvation. That they've been involved in atrocities Lord. That make them not even fit. For the kingdom of God. Ah, in the name of the Lord Jesus. We pray right now. Right now. Ah, that you help. Pray right now that you save. We pray right now that you touch. We pray right now that you strengthen. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Those Lord. Who still can. Donate blood because. Of the areas and the environments they have ex been exposed to. Those that are no longer comfortable at a family reunion. Those, Lord, that are missing limbs. No longer can hear. Some are blinded. Because they said, I will serve. We pray for them now. Those that are taking opioids to get rid of the pain. We pray for them now. Hallelujah. In the name of the Lord Jesus. We pray for them now, Lord. Those that are even with having the financial ability to stay in a home. Those that sleep homeless. Those that travel and wander. Those that live in tents. Not because they are in poverty. But because of service to the country. Ah, hallelujah. Help us, Lord. Do better. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Help us Christians, Lord. Hallelujah. Who have declared in accordance to the word, world, word, 
We are not our own. We've been bought with a price. Those who are striving to endure as a good soldier. Help us, Lord. Not be full of complaints. Full of pride. Full of selfishness. Help us, Lord, be about our Father's business. Help us work well with others. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. Help us to be good soldiers. Help us, Lord. We know you're protecting. We know you're shielding. We know you're our strength. We know you're our power. We ask these things right now. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. And while you're helping Lord. We pray right now. Not just for the veterans Lord. We pray right now Lord. For our heroic school teachers. Yes. 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 Ah, those that are still. Bless them, Lord. Those that are going in the classrooms. Not knowing. Having no idea the condition of the student. In a pandemic, those that are around children who wear masks, some who do not. And yet, Lord, they're raising the next generation and teaching. Uh, they deserve our gratitude and our prayer. We pray for every teacher on every level. Hallelujah. Every level, every level. In the name of the Lord Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Ah. Bless them, Lord Jesus. Bless them, Lord. Glory to God with the strength that they need, God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory to God. The creative spirit, God. Mm. Hallelujah. The motivation, the inspiration, the direction. Oh, God, the clarity in mind and heart and spirit Hallelujah. that they need, God, the focus, the determination, oh, the glory. will, God, hallelujah, that they need, God, in every area, God, hallelujah, hallelujah glory, even before they arrive, oh, God, into the classroom, God, glory, let God, let them wake up, God, with the energy god hallelujah hallelujah with focus god and enthusiasm god hallelujah to do what they need to do throughout the day god throughout the day replenish their energy and their strength god glory to god bless oh god their bless communication with their parents god hallelujah the agreement oh god let there be teamwork let it be oh, law between teachers and parents god ah. glory to god for the well-being of our children the well-being hallelujah Help hallelujah us all be on the same page god Pushing forward, moving forward, mm. working together, God. Ah. Hallelujah, glory to God. Bringing about change that is needed, God. Bringing about and being a positive influence. Yes, Lord. On our children, Lord Jesus. We just ask your blessings for them, Lord Jesus. Bless, Lord. Even as they leave the classroom, having to take assignments home and still working, ah. God, after hours, grading papers, God, and preparing curriculums, God. We pray that you would just give them the strength they need in their mind. Give them now, God. Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory to God as they go from the classroom to home. Yes. Go from taking care of students to taking care of their own families. Hallelujah. To taking care of themselves, God. Hallelujah. And storing it all over day after day. God, we pray that they don't be burnt out. Oh, God, that they see, oh, God, oh, God, the light ahead, oh, uh, God, that they understand and know, God, that their labor is not in vain. Yes, oh, Lord. God, let them, oh, God, feel rewarded even uh, in the midst of everything that's going on, God, mm. in our society, God, and the indirect and direct effects that it has on our children, God, on our school system, God. Hallelujah. Encourage their hearts, oh God. Let them not lose desire to teach, to inspire. 
hallelujah, mm. to impart yes, Lord. to our children, God. Let them know that they make a difference, mm. that they're needed, God. Oh, God, even bless and help us, God, to be more in place with more showing Lord. them that they're needed, God, with showing your love and your yes, care Lord and Jesus. attentiveness to our teachers, oh, God. Pray for their well-being, God, for their encouragement, God. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah, that they know that they're not alone, that they're not doing anything that's in vain, that it's not going unnoticed. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. God, we pray that gratitude will even mm. arise in our children's hearts, God. Glory to God, that they will be more appreciative and show that, express that to their teachers, God. Yes, Lord. Let the atmosphere on uh, every school campus reflect your tender care and love. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Glory to God. All throughout the hallways, God. Yes, throughout Lord. the campus, God. Hallelujah. From room to room, God. From events to events. Yes, from Lord. class to class. From activity to activity. Oh, God. Hallelujah. Be glorified. We pray even for those that don't believe in you, God. Yes, that Lord. Not even looking to you or trusting you or depending mm. on you. We stand in the gap on their behalf, God. Yes, and we Lord. pray for them, oh God, that you strengthen and help them just the same. And while you're helping them, Lord, bring them to the understanding and to the knowledge of who you are, God. They have a desire to be in relationship with you, Lord. Mm. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Bless Hallelujah. the teachers, oh God, that are Bless walking in a Christian faith, oh yes, God. Lord Jesus. That they stand firm in the faith. That they be encouraged in the uh, faith. That they don't take down, that they do not faint. Mm. Hallelujah. Glory to God. But that they keep walking as soldiers in your army, oh God. Glory to God. That they know that their prayers are not in vain, God. That you hear them. Ah. Hallelujah. And glory to God that you fight for them. Fight, Lord. Fight for them, God. Fight for them. Be the defender that they need. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Pray for special needs children. Yes, Lord. The right teacher now. Teacher and staff, oh God. Ah. God. Teaching them and caring for them. We pray that you increase them, God, in every way. Increase them in knowledge and understanding and patience, God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Mm. Cause things to work in their favor. Yes, Hallelujah. Lord. Strategies, God. Give them new strategies, new, new strategy. insight. Oh, God, new foresight, oh, God, for planning and preparing for our special needs children. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Thank you, God. Don't forget a one, Lord. Yes, Remember Lord. Remember every teacher. Every. Remember every principal. Yes, Lord. Remember every teacher's aide. Mm. Remember every student. Remember every school bus driver. Yes, Lord. Glory to God. Remember everyone that's assisted in every capacity, oh God, of our school system. Hallelujah. Glory to God that our children be protected, that they be cared for, mm. that they be nurtured, that they be brought up yes, in fear and knowledge of the one true living God. Hallelujah. Glory Hallelujah, to God. Hallelujah, Lord Jesus. Lord, we thank you, Lord, for there still being food on the shelves. Yes. Hallelujah, Lord. Still being cleaners, grocery stores. And Lord, we pray, Lord. Pray, Lord Jesus. From the manufacturers, for those that do the canning, mm. and the packaging, and the cleaning. Those that work at, hallelujah, Lord, meat processing plants. Those that pick the, the farmers that grow the, the crops and yes. all the vegetables. Yes, God. Lord, the manufacturer and the tractors, Lord, that uh, they go out and the farmers and agriculture, Lord, that go out and with the irrigation, Lord, and 
and, 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 and harvest the food. Those manufacturers, Lord, that package and clean and separate, Lord, prepare it, Lord. And, the, and Lord, those involved in the transportation industry, Lord. Hallelujah. The railroaders, Lord, the engineers, the conductors, Lord, the dispatchers, Lord, those that work on the tracks and the manifest, Lord Jesus, those, Lord Jesus, that work on the equipment, Lord, the safety professionals, Lord, all the truckers, Lord, that, hallelujah, these things do not just magically appear throughout the nation and the world, Lord, they're those, Lord, that get behind large vehicles, Lord, and go across the highways, Lord, delivering, Lord, all across the nation, Lord. All across the world, Lord, there are people who are uh, whose profession it is, Lord, to drive. Lord, with the danger and violence that's out there, Lord, we pray your keeping power. Keep them, Lord. Keep them, Lord. Ah, Lord, there, uh, there, the roads are collapsing and some uh, sunken holes, Lord, and different things can happen, Lord, and we're about to get into the winter season, Lord, and icy roads, Lord. We pray your protection on them in the name of the Lord Jesus. We do not take them for granted. Hallelujah. If the, if the truckers go on strike today, within three weeks, Lord, they estimate within three weeks, there'll be no food in stores. And Lord, we pray for them right now. Bless them. Keep them, encourage them, strengthen them in the name of the Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. We need every worker. Hallelujah. Those that load the trucks, those that get on the forklifts at the warehouse and the docks, Lord. Those that load up the pallets, Lord. Those that secure the pallets, Lord. We need every worker, Lord. Those that are working on the roads right now, Lord. And those that clear uh, when there are hazards, Lord, that there's their, that's their task, Lord. We pray for them now, Lord. We pray for every grocer, small and large, convenience stores, large super stores, big product stores. We pray for them now. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. They are a necessity. They are vital. From the stockers, Lord, those that unload, those that put it on the shelves, to the cashiers, the bakery, the deli, the managers, the pharmacy, security. We pray for them now. In the name of the Lord Jesus. There's shooting in stores. There's stealing. There's crime. There's violence. And Lord, protect them. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Some are not compensated enough. Protect them. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Many are striving and working, Lord, in society, Lord. Not to buy new things. But to provide necessity. For their household. Do it right now Lord. Help them Lord. Shield them Lord. Encourage them Lord. We're not coming Lord in pettiness today Lord. But we understand Lord. That this is a big team effort. And we need help Lord. We need your help. We need your help Lord. Hallelujah. Even as we uh, Lord uh, are, are consuming these foods Lord and sometimes they're recalled Lord and they have uh, USDA and FDA and different approval agencies out there Lord whose responsibility is to make sure the food is correct to make sure things are right and to make sure things don't hurt and don't poison Lord. Oh we all need your help Lord. Your help. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Do it for your glory. We thank you right now for them, Lord. We thank you, Lord, for the store around the corner, down the block, up the way, Lord, been open. We thank you when we go in there, Lord, there is food. We do not take that for granted, Lord. Hallelujah. We do not take that for granted, Lord. I know many think it's automatic, Lord, but there are some countries even now where people are starving who wish they could get a sandwich. 
Ah, glory, Lord. And so, Lord, it's only right that we say thank you. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, thank you Lord. for your many blessings. Yeah. Just like Jesus did when he took the fish and the loaves of bread and he broke them and he blessed them. He gave thanks. We thank you, Lord. Thank you. Hallelujah. It does not have to be like this. It doesn't have to be this good. We don't have to have this many options. But you've been so good. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. In this great country, Lord, you've been so good here in America. Where we can even sometimes, Lord, pull up to a place, tell them what they want, and they hand it out in a car. Ah, glory. Others are struggling. Help us, Lord. Help us to do right by our taxes, by our giving, that there be food. No one is hungry. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. We pray for security, Lord. Security all over. Before we pray for law enforcement, we pray for those, Lord, who are many times not even respected, not adhered to, to have the task of standing before entrances, trying to invert, uh, encourage folks to comply with Mass mandates. Some have been stabbed. Some have been beaten. Oh, Lord, we are yet standing in the need of help. Lord, we thank you, Lord, for those, Lord, that wear uniforms similar to law enforcement, but do not have the same authority. Working all over grocery stores and libraries and some in hospitals some in churches some in schools Lord protect them ah, protect them Lord in the name of the Lord Jesus Lord we pray for our first responders those who run toward the danger and not away those who are called, no matter the day, the vacation, the holiday, the time, those who are summoned at 3.30 in the morning, those are, who are held to a higher sense of duty and responsibility. Oh, we pray for our law enforcement. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Often the brunt of many complaints. But oh Lord, we pray for them now. We pray for their strength. We know the trend that law enforcement are leaving at such an alarming rate. Many are retiring. Many are tired and just leaving the profession. Uh, and as they leave, Lord, in many cases there, there's a gap or a void. Those that would do harm. Selling drugs. Sexual assault. Assault with deadly weapons. Stealing. Killing. Cheating. Robbing. Or going unchecked. Oh God. We pray Lord. That they will continue to serve heroically. And with a higher call and purpose. Many have been ambushed while just, while just sitting in their car. Sometimes it's been unknown assailants having no connection with that law enforcement officer. But because of what they wear, because of who they identify with, 
They are being gunned down at an alarming rate. Ah, Lord, what a bulletproof vest cannot do, you do. Hallelujah. We pray for them, Lord. Pray for them right now. That many young folk will still be recruited and go in not with a sense of entitlement but with a sense of duty and a higher call. Pray for the fire department. Ah, everyone associated with them. Those that maintain the vehicles. Those that dispatch. Paramedics that work hand in hand with them. We pray for them right now. Oh, Lord, stretch out your hand. Those that had to run toward the fire, toward the atrocity, toward the vehicle that's trapped with the person trapped, gasoline leaking out. Those that have to see death at another level. We pray for them right now. Hallelujah. Pray for them that you protect them with their personal protective equipment. Self-contained breathing apparatus. Helmets and boots. Fire retardant equipment cannot do. We pray that you shield. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We recognize that you have the power. You have the power. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Paramedics, Lord. Those that are driving ambulances. Going to pick up patients. We see a request here even locally where. Firemen are requesting to, to get bulletproof vests. Ah, oh, Lord. We need your help. Hallelujah. We, we need your help. Right now, like never before, we take time to pray for them. Men and women alike, serving hard. Pray for their families. They're listening to emergency radio scanners. Wondering if their loved one will ever come back in that door. Those who have recently had to remember the last embrace. Ah, oh, Lord. We need your help, Lord. We some summon you, Lord. We call on you, Lord. To be that very help now. Hallelujah. We're not going to wait. Until it gets worse. And then decide Lord. To ask you then. We're not going to wait Lord. Until there's. We're put on hold. On 911. We're not going to wait Lord. Till there's no food on the shelves. We're not going to wait Lord. Until there's no electricity. Ah, Lord. Help, Lord. Even those, Lord, that maintain the electrical grids, the plumbers, and different ones, Lord, that labor, Lord, in areas that are, receive very little attention until something goes wrong. Hallelujah. Before the main blizzard, we ask you for your help. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Before the next power outage, we ask you for your help. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. Right now, right now. Hallelujah. We lean on you, Lord. We call on you, Lord. Do it now, Lord, for your glory. Yeah, yeah. For your glory, for your praise. Because you are God. 
Because there's none like you, Lord. Ah, Lord, help us to be keepers of our neighbors. Help us, Lord Jesus, to have our brothers and sisters back. Help us, Lord Jesus, to be concerned with not with just our own household. Ah, Lord, in the name of the Lord Jesus. Ah, many are hurting now. Help those whose job it is, Lord, to comfort the grieving. We pray, Lord, for all of the clergy. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. All over, Lord. All over, Lord. During this pandemic, Lord, millions have died. Many have had. Many have called. I don't know of a preacher myself, Lord, who has not been impacted by this pandemic. Hallelujah. Help us to stand. Help us to declare. Help us to comfort. Help us to be a strength, Lord. Ah, Lord, and when it's all over, help us in our own personal grief. In the name of the Lord Jesus, uh, we pray for every church, every temple, every tabernacle, tabernacle, every house of God, the house of prayer, every building, every sale meeting, everywhere the people of God are assembled, whether they are assembled officially or unofficially, every Bible study. Help right now. Oh, in the name of the Lord Jesus. So many need your help. So many are, what, are asking, are all the churches going to close down? Help them, Lord. Ah, in the name of the Lord Jesus. Help our churches, Lord, to reflect Christ and not the charisma of the preacher. Help us to talk about you. You, Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And not about the first family. Yes. Help us to be focused on the, the father's business. Yes. And not our own agenda. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Yes. We thank you right now Lord, you, Lord. Because we know you have set. Men and women. In positions throughout the earth. To declare your word. Yes. We pray right now. They be not weary in well doing. In due season they shall reap if they faint not. We pray for every apostle, teacher, evangelist, elder, brother, sister, deacon, deaconess, missionary, usher, musician, greeter, Lord, everyone. Hallelujah. We all need your help. None can do it without you. But oh, we can do all things through Christ. Strengthen us. Strengthen us now, Lord. Hallelujah. The task is at hand. Strengthen us now, Lord. Soon to come back. Strengthen us now, Lord. Hallelujah. To reflect your glory in the midst of gloom. Strengthen us now, Lord. Wipe the weary eyes. Strengthen us now, Lord. To strengthen families. Strengthen us now, Lord. To encourage children. Strengthen us now, Lord. Ah, to do your work. And to work while it is day because night cometh when no one can work. Help us now, Lord. We are calling on you now, Lord. Hallelujah. Pray for all those that are grieving. Grieving loss. Pray for those, Lord, that lost in the Asherdome in Houston. Houston, Texas. Ah, young children. Young folk. Crushed. Ah, glory. We pray for the families. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes, we know that, that it may not seem like a large number, Lord. But those are the ones that have passed on. But just one lost life. It's monumental. Just one lost life. It's tragic. Just one lost life. Is a catastrophe. Oh Lord. Help us Lord. Help them Lord. 
those that are grieving, Lord, those who, who went for a night of entertainment, not knowing that their life was going to fade away in a vapor. Ah, glory. And at a time when many would point fingers, we pray, Lord, for community unity in the name of the Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You have a way through your gospel yes. of bringing people together. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Do it right now. now. Right now, Lord, they're suffering. Not everyone died. Some were just crippled. Still struggling. Some standing with the grief or the guilt. Why was I left alive? Help right now. Help the entertainers, Lord, that are, uh, uh, that, that, that do such a, uh, get such a draw and such a crowd. And so many people are pleased with the entertainers until something goes wrong and then they're trashed. Help them, Lord. That's a lot. That's a burden. Help them, Lord. Money can't do it. Hallelujah, Lord. I bear witness, Lord. Hallelujah. Many things we go through, money and secular counseling alone cannot do it. We need your help, Lord. Ah, glory. I need your help. We need your help. They need your help. We all need your help, Lord. And we call on you now. Uh, we call on you now, Lord. Now, Lord. Now, Lord. Lord, even our professional athletes, many, Lord, appear to be living the dream. They need your help. Many millionaires that are playing professionally are depressed, are suicidal, are struggling. Hallelujah. They need the Holy Ghost, many. Hallelujah. Help them, Lord. Protect them, Lord. Some are just a mist. Step away from being paralyzed. Need your help, Lord. Need your help, Lord. Entertainers all over. Need your help. Need your strength. Need your protection. Hallelujah, Lord. All need you. People need you like never before. We pray right now, Lord, for even those, Lord, who do not believe, who do not understand, who feel like they can do it in their own power. We pray for them now. Many of us have been there, Lord, feeling like we've had it together. Feeling like we knew the answer, Lord. But you are the answer, Lord. You are the answer, Lord. Ah, glory. glory. We pray right now, Lord, for all of them, our retirees, those who no longer work formally, those who are no longer required to report to a work center every day. Those who wear a crown of wisdom and experience. Some who have been set off and not and ostracized because of their age. Some of them, Lord, many of them in their mouth, they have the key to the next direction. We pray for them now. Hallelujah. All our seniors. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. All our seniors that have endured, have lived to talk about it, yeah. lived to tell about it. Those who bear the scars in their body and their mind of going through for the name's sake. Hallelujah. We pray for them now. Some are no longer preaching, no longer teaching, no longer on the praise team. Oh, Lord, but their prayers are what's holding it all together. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Some have labored so much. 
that they're hurting in their bodies now for what they did in the kingdom. Ah, Lord. Some, Lord, did not chase the money. They chased you. Help them now. Help us, Lord, to do better, to do right. Help us, Lord, to show your love. Help us, Lord, Ah, uh, because we all, many of us, hope to be there one day. Ah, uh, whatsoever a man soweth, that shall he also weep. Extend their life, Lord. Give them good health. Good health, Lord. Hallelujah. Good strength. Hallelujah, Lord. Let them, Lord, see their grandchildren and their great-grandchildren. Hallelujah. Let them see good days. Let them see a great outlook. Hallelujah. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Let them be invited to be a part again of the kingdom. Part of the work. Part of the work and of the ministry. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Help them, Lord, in their creative thinking, Lord. To write songs and to Write benefits, Lord, and the right plays, Lord, and entrepreneurship, Lord, well into their 70s and their 80s, Lord. In the name of the Lord Jesus, help them to see their visions and their dreams from a youth come forth. Let them see the manifestation of their prayers on their children and on their grandchildren. Let their house be blessed. Let their car be blessed. Their car be blessed. Let everything they touch prosper. Whatsoever they doeth, according to Psalms chapter number one. Whatsoever they touch, whatsoever they become a part of, whatsoever they join, whatsoever they create, whatsoever they develop, whatsoever they doeth, let it prosper. Let it blow up, Lord. Let it prosper, Lord. Let it add years, Lord, and and even create wealth, Lord, for the next generation. In the name of the Lord Jesus, Lord. Don't, uh, Lord, protect them from scams. Protect them from those swindlers and cons, Lord, that will try to come, Lord, and deceive them out of their retirement, out of their wealth, out of their investments, out of their 401ks, Lord. Protect them now. Protect, Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. In the name of the Lord Jesus, put your shield of protection around their house, Lord, around their dwelling, wherever they lay their head, Lord. Let them not be, Lord, looked upon as an easy prey, Lord. Hallelujah. We pray right now, Lord, that you shield them. You do what? You do for them what the gun behind the door can't do. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Those, Lord, have lived and seen their spouse taken home and who live alone now, Lord. Oh, Lord, we pray right now, not one second of loneliness. Ah, be with them, Lord, in such a special way. Right now, Lord, oh, Lord, this is a prayer for all. Even those, Lord, we did not... I call out their occupation, Lord. We're, we're always praying for the health providers. Always praying for those, Lord, that have arrived at a certain level, Lord. But now we pray, Lord, for those who really make it come together and work. Ah, uh, Lord. Those that are driving Uber and those that are driving, Lord, Jesus Lyft and those that are driving taxis, Lord, and shuttles, Lord, we pray for them now. City bus drivers, those involved in transportation, those that are picking up seniors and taking them to their appointments, we pray for them now. Those that sit with seniors, we pray for them now in the name of the Lord Jesus. Those that work at housing agencies, Lord, those that work giving out benefits, we pray for them now, Lord. Hallelujah. Local, state, federal workers at all levels, we pray for them now, Lord. Those that work in and out of the court systems, we pray for them now, now, now Lord. All the paralegals, Lord. All the attorneys, Lord. Those that uh, are judges, we need your help, Lord. In every facet, those that uh, deal with the cleanliness of our society, those that collect refuge, garbage, 
those that transport waste. We all need your help. We all need your help. The garbage mans go. If the garbage and refuse workers, Lord, go on strike for a month, we just have a smelly town with diseases and flies throughout. We thank you for them. Thank you for them coming in the neighborhoods, Lord. Around the way, up the street, down the corner, around the block, in the cut. Thank you, Lord. Bless them now. Those that are still delivering mail. All other services, Lord. Delivering food. On the roadway. Need your help. Collectively. Those who have to deal with the departed. Those that are working, Lord, in the funeral homes, funeral chapels, autopsies. Those that are working, doing things, Lord, that others cannot do. Strengthen them. Help them. Is our prayer. In the name of the Lord Jesus. It is our desire that we leave out no category. We understand, Lord, we cannot touch every profession. Even those that are volunteers, those that are on rescue missions, Lord, those that are working in zoos, Lord. Every avenue. We all need your help. We need our brothers and our sisters to continue to be strong in the Lord. Continue to work as unto the Lord. Continue to fulfill their task, their duty, their calling, their purpose. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We come against the spirit of indifference and them against us. Keep it together, Lord. Help us keep it together. Hallelujah. Where none is greater than any, but you are greater than all. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Help every form of our government, yeah. regardless to who is in power. From the White House to the courthouse. Help. Help our scientists our developers, our researchers. Give them the keys and the answers for cancer, diabetes, Alzheimer's. Give it to them, Lord. It's here in the earth. Give it to them. Not for our financial wealth but for your glory in the name of the Lord Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. hallelujah and we praise you and thank you, thank you God. for allowing us this time once again ah. we know Lord that every time we pray Every time your people pray, you hear us. And because you hear us, we just believe and know by faith yes. we shall have those things we have petitioned you for. And if you grace us with a tomorrow, yes, yes. we vow to give you glory and, praise. glory and praise. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah.